You have only one choice. The ring must be destroyed. And what are we waiting for? <laughs> The ring cannot be destroyed, Gimli, son of Gloin, by any craft that we here possess. The ring was made in the fires of Mount Doom. Only there can it be unmade. It must be taken deep into Mordor and cast back into the fiery chasm from whence it came. One of you must do this. One does not simply walk into Mordor. Its black gates are guarded by more than just orcs. There is evil there that does not sleep. The great eye is ever watchful. It is a barren wasteland, riddled with fire and ash and dust. The very air you breathe is a poisonous fume. Not with 10,000 men could you do this. It is folly. Have you heard nothing Lord Elrond has said? The ring must be destroyed. And I suppose you think you're the one to do it. And if we fail, what then? What happens when Sauron takes back what is his? I will be dead before I see the ring in the hands of an elf! No one trust an elf! I will take the ring to Mordor. No. I do not know the way. I will help you bear this burden, Frodo Baggins, as long as it is yours to bear. If by my life or death, I can protect you. I will. You have my sword. And you have my bow. And my axe. Carry the face of his all, little one. This is indeed the will of the council. Gondor will see it done. Here! Mr. Frodo's not going anywhere without me. No, indeed, it is hardly possible to separate you even when he is summoned to a secret council and you are not. Wait! We're coming too! We'll have to send us home tied up in a sack to stuff it. Anyway, you need people of intelligence on this sort of mission. Quest. Well, that rules you out, Nick. My companions. So be it. You shall be the Fellowship of the Ring. Right. Where are we going? <laughs>